All right, so I have 3DO. I had three 3DOs. This is my. I had two top loaders, which is this. And then I had one front loader. I sold the front loader. And then I got a feedback that it just needed some oiling on the lens. So I got, I got a good, good deal out of that. And then I have this one. And then I have another one of these complete that works. And I got a little memory upgrade for it too. Which is pretty fun. This one, however, needs something. So I can't remember. I know this. So one thing I lost on this. It's one of my worst problems. I play around with stuff. This is a little LED thing here. I, I lost it. I don't know why. I have no idea where it is. So, this is the inside of one of these. If you've never seen them. That's why I do this. So you can kind of take a look. It's got its own power supply. So, And then this is my issue on this one. And the issue and it just has one controller for it, and that's the controller for it. So, the problem with this one, it's lens related. That goes on there like that. So this is going to be, there's a wire that's off it, but I think it's more than just that problem. So in order to get these off, there's three or four different little pull-up. You gotta go side by side. <sighs> I gotta get to it. It's kinda hard, but you can't do it with that on though. No. And you gotta <sighs> Yeah, I got it. Yeah. You have to go side by side to pull it up. And then that comes out. It's one cable. There's like three cables on this. So this one had a, a read issue. That's all bent up. I'm not sure how that happened. But we can fix that. So. Um, and then there's this one here. There's two more. It's not just one. There's three different connections. Two of them are the pull-ups. Side by side. It's hard to see. Right over here. This, so there's one, two, and then there's another one in there. You gotta keep pulling side by side as you pull it up. All right, so then there's plug here. Actually, there's four different connections on this one here. This one just comes off, and then there's this one. But this is the one that's broken. That's what. That's how it looks there. I'm missing a little pin here or there's something else that's supposed to go here see how these come up side by side and you push them back down like this and as you push them in and it locks them in see right here and that locks in this one just pulls out that one just pulls out and this one just pulls out so this one wasn't reading and I'm not sure if I remember for it. Oh, I know there's a wire off here that's my first thing. So I'm going to see if I can put this wire back on. I should have the soldering skills to do that, but not necessarily. Because <laughs> I've tried before and I, I still don't get it. But we're going to... This is the best thing ever. It's really cheap and heats up really quick. And shuts off really fast. It doesn't take up a lot of space. And this is actually hotter than a cord one. I used to use cord and they used to bang it around everywhere. And this usually heats up within a few seconds. So I need to get this wire back on. 
That was my. It's hard to see it. I need to use these glasses here. So, as seen on TV once in a while is pretty cool. Mighty sight. I use these all the time. Definitely, it's got a little LED light on it, so I can't see it. Without... I just hit something. With it. So I have to come closer now. I gotta find some solder to put this back on. So I'm only as good as heating it up, putting the wire back on, heating it up, and putting it, taking it off. I the extent of my soldering skills. I think I know how to solder by now, but I just don't. Such an easy concept too, but I just can't seem to get it. I don't know why. Things I could do if I knew electronics and if I could solder. Ooh, places I could go. But I don't think it's gonna happen. So we just make do with what I can do. Which is a lot, even without that. Now I need to get this on there. Yeah, that would have been pretty easy. Last time I did this, I got it on there and then it fell off on me. I don't want to go through all that for nothing. Because to put that back on is just as much of a pain as it was to take it off. Yeah, so I'm done. I hit it. And um, I'm out of here with that. So. Let's see if we can do this again. Last time I did this, I put it all back together and then the wire fell off. I was like, ah, bonkers. So let's see now. So there's lots of things going on with this. Key one is this one. This one here. You gotta get this one on. It's the other two, the side by side ones. Actually, I gotta lift them back up again. So that would make no sense to have them down. I wanna lift these up, get them ready to go. Right now they're in the lock position. I'm gonna unlock them. Because I can't unlock it while I'm trying to put it on. There's not a lot of space over there. There we go. So we're both unlocked here, ready to go. And then you slide them in and... Alright, that's that. Okay, so now we're back to this again. Alright, so one goes here. I actually might have a lens for this. I have some extra lenses I bought, and I don't know if... Placement lens, and I don't know if it's for these or not. But I don't think this was spinning. I don't remember it spinning. That's what this. That's where I was confused. And then I saw a wire was off, but I wasn't positive that was why it wasn't spinning. We're gonna find out. So I'm gonna sell this one, but no matter what, it's gonna be for parts because it's missing some some stuff. Everybody came to the back door to they their waiting while we were in the front door. Oh, really? It would, Joe, Joan's uh, daughter realized she must knock me down. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, people are crazy with food. Alright, so. Now we're back to the ones that are a pain. So I got that one on. Re it up. Rewired up. So they're easy to put on once you. But it's sometimes they go in before it locks, and then you gotta lift it up again. So it's a real pain in the buns. Can't have that plastic thing on here. I can't really get two. I had to put the camera up there because I can't. It would be in my way or down here. But you get the concept. So then this goes in there. Gotta hear it lock in there. See that one just locked in, so I'm good there. I'm lock and loaded. I still haven't got it locked in yet. So if I get it in there, it's definitely still in there. Then I can get the thing to go back down. This is such a pain, these two. 
it's in there. I need this to go back down. It's not doing it for me. Bummer. That's all. I don't. There it goes. I think I got it. See how we gotta lock it back in there. Same with this one. First, you gotta get it in there, and then you gotta lock it back in. A weird concept is two different things going on at the same time. I think I got it. I think we did it. Let's see what happens. So this is easy because it's just um, power and audio video, which I have. I'll be here ready to go. And this is the. This is almost complete. I'm just missing. I go on that way. It goes in that. Space you gotta get in there. Okay. And then this should go on down here like this. Now I find a 3D O game. But I'm pretty sure this works otherwise. It has spin issue. I'm right. I'm positive. To remember. Okay, so let me get well let's do this. Let's get to it. Oops, I just shut it off. Power first. Hold on. And then I need to get to, to audio video. Right. Get you over there now. The job is done. All right. So there's also I think a. S video on this in RF. S video nobody ever used. But it's almost like the HDMI wannabe S video. It's kind of like that. Alright, so I don't have power. Nope. And then on the activations right here. Cool. Now I'm gonna find a game. All right. So, 3D old buffet. Let's give it a whirl. I don't think this spins. I'm pretty sure it's not going to spin, but well, let's see what happens. Yeah, see, it's, it's making a flicker too, and I'm not sure why that is. See, when I put that down, that's flickering. So I don't know if this has a motherboard problem or that's how I'm gonna sell its parts because it's got something going on. It may be motherboard related, I don't know. So you can see how it's flickering like that, it shouldn't flicker like that. You should push that in and then it should go. Let me try something. So let's activate it as if the door is off. See it never spins. Yeah, and it's flickering, I shouldn't do that. 
I don't think it, oh, it's not plug right now. So it has this is something that doesn't spin. I don't know why. I mean, this is an old razor. Yeah, I'll look. Uh, that's an old razor. You know? Okay. I mean, what? So, all right. Well, I'll check it out. Well, it's not even. Yeah. No. Uh, 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 yes, that's how that's going to go. Stock storage manager. So I'm going to sell this one missing. It's missing this LED cover. And it. Let's press X. No one says there an X. Where's there an X? Huh. Yeah, I'm not sure right here now. It should it, it's, it's reading, but this isn't spinning. And if I remember, I swap these out. I'm gonna swap them out again. I probably will. And I think this lens works in the other one. Didn't work in this one. So that tells me. I don't know if I really want to play around. I think I'm just going to sell it this way. Good enough. So I'll make a little quick video for the listing and just be that way. So that's my 3D. It works. Everything works except for this. For whatever reason, I think it's motherboard related. Because the connection for the spindle. Is one of these. Let me just make sure I got that on. The spindle. Which one's the spindle again? Hold on. Oh, of course. The spindle is. So when I click that, it should, the spindle should be spinning. Also, oh, it's this one. This is your spindle right here. So either maybe the spindle doesn't work, but I think I remember it working in the other one. Maybe the connection on the motherboard spindle is not working. If I'm correct. So that's how I'm gonna move. I have no 3D. I want to find out where the 3D buffet is. Pretty cool. Alright, so that's how that's gonna go. 